Hello hackers, Ivan is here and today we are going to perform some kind of specific and exotic hardware hacking related to telecom. No, it's not GSM or it's not your iPhone, but it's also quite interesting and if you're the red teamer, you must have to know about it. So today we are going to hack DAC phones and uh, as a victim we are using Panasonic KX TGB 110. Uh, before going deeper, let's read more about that specific device, uh, what frequency it's working on and what standard it's using. So let's visit the official Panasonic website, find the manual and find the specifications. And as you can see, uh, the standard is DECT, so it's Digital Enhanced Cordless Telecommunications. Uh, you can easily find and read about it uh, across the internet. So, the article is quite long if we're talking about Wikipedia, and I don't think you already you know to listen uh, how I read it. And the second crucial part which we are looking for is frequency range, which in our case is between 1881 and 1897 megahertz. So, uh, next, let me introduce you to the devices which we are going to use uh, within this exercise. So the first one is of course the victim, so the Panasonic phone and it's DAC. And we are going to hack this particular toy. So as you may understand, uh, the radio waves are flowing back and forth between the phone and the base. And we are going to intercept this particular signal, uh, listen it and uh, try to understand if it's crucial or not. Mm. As the intercepting stuff, we are using HackerF, so it's quite uh, default and standard, so yeah. So first of all, let me connect the deck phone to the line and power supply and uh, start exercising. But before going further, let's imagine that you are a teamer. The client hired you to perform some kind of reteaming activities yeah, and to understand if it's possible to breach the perimeter and to steal some kind of internal confidential data. So oh, you agreed with that, you signed all of the necessary papers, so yeah, uh, on the subject, uh, and you started performing that. And during the reconnaissance stage, you found the CEO is using deck phones, you know, to discuss some kind of, uh, to discuss business, literally, yeah? And knowing that, you need to intercept that signal and uh, find the way how to steal the data. In that case, you, purcha you purchased the deck phone and started, you know, uh, exploiting in your lab. So, what next and how to hack it? Uh, fortunately, fortunately for us, DECT is quite old uh, standard, and a lot of the, uh, a lot of um, know, phones are using that. I mean, you know, home phones, uh, or if we're talking about you know offices, office phones. And we have we have already have a GitHub repository from Pavel Yazev. Uh, he created a GR DEC2 library, which can help us to intercept the signal, listen it, and of course, if it's needed to record. Uh, it has an instruction. Oh, sorry. It has an instruction how to install it, how to use it. So let's try to follow those steps and perform that hack. First of all, we need to download that repository and uh, build it. Unfortunately, uh, this particular line is not correct enough. So as you can see, it's Git uh, uh, instead of HTTPS. So basically, if you just uh, copy paste it um, into your terminal, so it won't work. 
Yeah, it will uh, tell you that it's cloning into JRDEC, but basically it's not working at all. So what you have to do is to scroll up, find the code uh, green button and uh, copy the HTTPS. So let's cancel it. So git clone this one. Now, as you can see, it's being cloned. So let's uh, change directory into gr. Okay, what's next? Oh, sorry. So we have already changed directory. Now let's make a directory called build. Okay. Then uh, move. Okay. I guess it's a little bit inconvenient. Let's do it like that. Okay. Okay. Much better. So cd build, okay, build, and cmake dot dot slash, then make. In my particular case, uh, we have, I have several, you know, mistakes, several errors, but uh, at the end, it's working. So uh, don't uh, take too much, yeah. Uh, don't think uh, more about it because yeah, at least in my case it's working. So I guess uh, it will wo it it will uh, be working in your case as well. So we perform make. So next one is sudo uh, make install for the password and sudo ld config. Okay, now we got it. If you did everything correctly. Uh, after launching GNU, compare, uh, GNU Radio Comparison, uh, okay, I guess you can, you can see it because of, okay, don't send, okay, let's try to open it again. So I guess if you did everything correctly, you uh, have to find a deck to, a deck to block and for sub blocks like console packet uh, packet decoder packet receiver and face diff okay so if you got it let's see what we have to do next as you can see uh pavel yazev kindly provided uh, the dedicated uh, the dedicated flow graph for hacker app so if you're using a HackerF, in that case, you should use the deck to HackerF GRC flow graph, which can also be found in the GR deck GRC directory. Okay, let's try to do that. So file, open, documents, okay, GR deck 2, GRC, and deck to HackerF GRC. Okay, as you can see, uh, the flow graph is ready and literally it's working from the box so let's launch it okay let's try to call someone so in my case just you know to test one two three four one. Oh. Please check your number and dial again. So yeah, sometimes you have to change select part to understand what uh, specific channel is working right now. Uh, in my experience, it's between one and two. So now let's call some of my friends. So his name is. Uh, why so let's call to him and try to talk intercept the signal and uh, hack it yeah zero fifty so i'm calling Hello. Hi, Loi. It's Ivan. 
Hi, Eisen. How are you doing? Good, good, good. Thank you, man. What about you? Good, good. All good. So, you know what I'm doing right now? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm intercepting uh, the deck phone signal. And uh, right now, our current discussion is intercepting. But don't worry, it's, inter it's intercepted by me. So, yeah, you can see yourself. Oh, no, you, not you can see, but you can hear yourself in the TV, you know, in the nearest future. Nice. <laughs> so, nice. So, yeah, well, thank you so much uh, for your help. Uh, so, yeah, see you later. See you, man. See you. Yeah, see you. Thank you. Bye. So, as you can see, we successfully intercepted the signal and listened what uh, Loa was talking about. And imagine, imagine if you are the CEO, you are CISO, and you are still using um, those specific devices. Maybe not this one Panasonic, but other um, other phones from uh, which is which are using that uh, standard, that protocol. So you are quite vulnerable. So make sure uh, during the phone calls, during the phone talks, you are not, you know, revealing some kind of confidential and private information. So yeah, hope you like the video. So I will, uh, I will keep all of the links uh, in the section below. So and if you like it, so please like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you guys. See you.